Hello mga kagri, kumusta? Agritalks page na po pala. Ngayon ay pag-uusapan po natin ang mga basic calculations sa soil science. Pero bago pong lahat ay paki-like and share po ng video na to. At kung bago ka pa lang sa channel na to ay paki-subscribe na rin at i-hit ang notification bell button para updated po kayo sa mga usaping may kaugnayan sa agrikultura. Maraming salamat po. Now we will discuss about equivalent weight of an element out from a molecule. Okay, so we have this example. We have magnesium hydroxide. So the formula in computing the equivalent weight is this. Equivalent weight is equal to molecular weight divided by valence electron. So this is the formula in determining equivalent weight. Okay, so first we will compute for the molecular weight of this molecule. So what we will determine first is the atomic weight of the individual element. So we have this magnesium 24, the oxygen is 16, and the hydrogen is 1. It's 1. But we have this subscript na 2. So we will multiply this to the atomic weight of these two elements. And not included po yung magnesium kasi ito lang po yung naka-enclose ng parenthesis. Okay? So, times 2, then times 2. So, copy 24, 16 times 2, that would be 32. 1 times 2, that would be 2. Tama, 2. 1 times 2 is 2. Okay. So, that would be um, A, then 58. So, 58 grams. Okay, so that's the molecular weight. 58 grams per mole. So, copy that. 58 grams per mole divided by the valence electron. What is valence electron? This valence electron is the valence of the active element from this molecule. So here, out of this molecule, the active element of this is the magnesium. Oxygen and hydrogen is just an additional. So they are not the active one. So the active one is the magnesium. And then, as you can see in the periodic table of elements, the valence electron of magnesium is 2. So we will put 2 here. Okay, so 58 grams per mole divided by 2, that would be um, 25 then 29 grams per mole. So this is the equivalent weight of this magnesium hydroxide. We will have another set of examples. We will just erase this one. Okay, so again we will have this calcium chloride. So CaCl2. So equivalent weight is equal to molecular weight divided by valence electron. Okay, so First, we will determine the atomic weight of these elements. So, calcium is 40, chlorine is 35, times 2. So, chlorine has a subscript of 2. So, times 2, that would be 70, just copy 40. 40 plus 70, that would be 110 grams per mole. Okay, so that would be the molecular weight of this calcium chloride. So we will put that value here as numerator. So 110 grams per mole divided by the valence electron. Here, as you can see, the active element 
out of this molecule is the calcium. Chlorine is just an additional. Okay, so the valence electron of calcium, as you can see in the periodic table of element, the valence electron is 2. Okay, so we will put uh, 2 here. So 110 divided by 2, that would be 55 grams per mole. So this is the equivalent weight of calcium chloride. So yun lang. Equivalent weight is equal to molecular weight divided by the valence electron. Okay, uh, hindi po palaging 2 yung valence electron ng ating mga elements. Magkaiba po yan. Each element has its individual valence electron. So, meron 1, meron 2, meron 3. Depende po yan. So, yung gawin nyo po ay tingnan nyo po sa periodic table nyo kung anong valence po ng active element dito sa ating molecule. So, ito lang po. It's very easy in computing the equivalent weight of our molecule. Yan po ang ating mga basic calculations sa soil science. I hope meron po kayong natutunan mula sa video na to. Kung meron kayong mga questions and clarification, please comment down below. And pakishare na rin po ang video na to. Especially to our agriculture students, to agriculturists, and also for our graduates in agriculture na gustong mag-take po ng ating licensure examination for agriculturists. Pakahalaga po ng topic na to sa inyong darating na examination. So please watch this video. This is for you. At ngayon, ito po si Master Arwin ng Agritox PH na nagsasabi, Every time we eat, let's thank God and thank our farmers.